Kenneth Damaris Topper was born at Newark, New Jersey in 1925 and was raised in the Lower Marion Township, Pennsylvania area. He was with the Bell Telephone System for 44 years, employed by the Bell Telephone Company of Pennsylvania, Western Electric Company, Bell Telephone Laboratories, and Bell Communications Research. He retired from the latter company in 1991. He was named a distinguished member of technical staff of Bell Labs in 1982 and held numerous United States and foreign patents. He was a specialist in radio communications technology and electronic crime countermeasures. He often testified for the U.S. government as an expert in communications-related crimes and national defense matters. Mr. Hopper was an active radio amateur, call letters KD7KH, formerly K2VAM, and W3ZML. He was a rifle and pistol target shooter and served in the U.S. Army 2nd Infantry Division during World War II. On D-Day, he was in the second wave at Normandy. He was later captured by the Germans in Belgium during the Battle of the Bulge while cutting German communication wires. Once liberated from the prisoner of war camp in Germany, he returned to his division and continued fighting with them until the end of World War II. He received the Bronze Star Medal, Combat Infantryman Badge, European Theater Ribbon with three battle stars, Presidential Unit Citation, Belgian Fourier, and other decorations. He was a life member of the American Radio Relay League, National Rifle Association, United States Revolver Association, Arizona State Rifle and Pistol Association, Citizens Rifle and Revolver Club of West Windsor, New Jersey, American Legion, Veterans of Foreign Wars, Institute of Electrical and Electronic Engineers, and Telephone Pioneers of America, and was a member of the Quarter Century Wireless Association and the West Valley Amateur Radio Club of Sun City, Arizona. Mr. Hopper has resided in the New River, Arizona area since 1994. Prior to that, he was a longtime resident of Holmdel, New Jersey. He was the communications officer for Holmdel Township a Holmdale Police Special Officer, and an exempt member of Holmdale Fire Company No. 1. He received the Public Safety Award given by Holmdale Police Fire and First Aid in 1975. He was an honorary trustee of the Bay Shore Task Force, New Jersey, and was a Kentucky Colonel. In 1988, he received the Robert L. Cosgriff Award from the IEEE International Conference on Crime Countermeasures. He was a distinguished pistol and rifle shooter. During the 1960s and 1970s, he was a master class competitive pistol shooter. He was also involved in firearms training activities and was an NRA and Arizona DPS certified firearms instructor. Mr. Hopper was both a deacon and an elder of the Dutch Reformed Church of Holmdale, New Jersey. Since relocating to Arizona, he has been a member of the Desert Hills Presbyterian Church of Carefree, Arizona. He is survived by his loving wife, Barbara Neowens of New River, a son, Christopher of Pleasanton, California, a daughter, Mrs. Phyllis A. Davis of Berkeley, California, and five grandchildren. God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. Therefore, we will not fear. Though the earth will change and the mountains will be shaken into the heart of the seas, for this God is our God forever and ever. He will be our guide, even unto death. If God is for us, who can be against us? He who did not spare his own son, but gave him up for us all, will he not also, along with him, graciously give us all things? It is God who justifies. Who is to condemn? It is Christ Jesus who died, yes, who was raised from the dead, who is at the right hand of God, who indeed intercedes for us. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation, or distress, or persecution, or famine, or nakedness, or peril, or sword? No, in all these things we are more than conquerors through him who loves us. 
For I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation has the power to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Let us pray. O God, whose days are without end and whose mercies cannot be numbered, make us, we beseech you, deeply sensible of the shortness and uncertainty of human life and let your spirit lead us in holiness and righteousness all our days that when we have served you in our generation, we may be gathered unto our fathers, having the testimony of a good conscience in the communion of the Christian church in the confidence of an unshakable faith, in the comfort of a reasonable and holy hope, in favor with you, our God, and in perfect charity with the world, all which we ask through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O God, we pray that the memory of our comrade, Sergeant Kenneth D. Hopper, United States Army, may be ever sacred in our hearts, that the sacrifice which he has offered for our country's cause may be acceptable in your sight, and that an entrance into your eternal peace may, by your pardoning grace, be open to him through Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive those who have debted against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Ship's company, I stand, put, Hasten. Unto Almighty God, we commend the soul of our brother departed, and we commit his body to the deep. In sure and certain hope of the resurrection unto eternal life through our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Let us pray. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you and give you peace. Amen. Ship's So proud.